Now the set. Here's the pitch. Swing and a shot up the middle. It's a base hit in the center field. Worth around third being waved home. Granderson up with it. There will be no throw. Ryan Zimmerman has done it again. He turns around a 99 mile an hour fastball and hits a bullet up the middle. He's been in any line drives and bombs of a home run. That time, a hard ground ball right up the middle ties the game. His 28th run batted of the year with Harper stopping at second. And with one out, Daniel Murphy coming up. It's the Nationals, one of the Mets one. Now Syndergaard sets, pitch to Rendon, swinging a ground ball left side, threw a base hit into left field. Harper scores from third. Zimmerman around third coming home. The throw is off the glove of the relay. Cut off man Reynolds, deflects into foul ground, backed up by the catcher Rivera, and Rendon goes to second base. It's a single to left. Two runs batted in for Anthony Rendon, his sixth and seventh RBIs of the year. And the Nationals have scored three times in the first inning against Noah Syndergaard. The cross-up of the wild pitch, huge. It's the Nationals three and the Mets one. If he had stopped around first and then went after the ball got away. Here's a swing by Taylor. Line drive in the center. Base hit. Rendon around third. Granderson's throw coming home. It is not in time. Gets by Rivera to the backstop. And Michael Taylor will go to second base. Taylor takes the 1-0 pitch back through the middle for the base hit. With two out, Bobby Henley's waving home Anthony Rendon. Granderson does not throw well despite eight outfield assists last year. Now Syndergaard sets. Long pause, the pitch. Swing and Ross, it's a ground ball. Throw into left field, a base hit through the hole. Rounding third, Taylor coming home. Throw to the plate. It is off the glove of Rivera. Off Taylor, backed up by Syndergaard. Michael Taylor has scored on a ground ball single through the hole by Joe Ross. For his first hit of the year, his second major league run batted in. Weider stops at second. The error on the throw by Granderson put Taylor into scoring position. And the Nationals have played it five runs here in the bottom of the first against Noah Syndergaard. It's Washington five and New York one. Dan Warden, the pitching coach, out to the mound as Trey Turner will come up to the plate for a second time in the bottom of the first inning. The 2-1 from Gilmart is launched deep left field. Anthony Rendon has his first home run of the season. That one is way back there, almost to the top of section 105. Anthony Rendon gets the zero out of the home run column. He has three RBIs in this game. And the Nationals lead it 6-3. to three. You must realize the month is about over, Dave. As soon as the warm weather comes in May, he's ready to go. And he absolutely tattooed that one. The 2-2 two -two to Zim. Swinging a fly ball, shallow right. Medium deep, actually. Bruce is there fighting the sun. He makes a two-handed catch. That'll allow Worth to tag at third, and he'll score. So Zim gets a sack fly. Bruce could not get in throwing position. He just had to worry about catching the ball, battling the sun monster. So Zim gets RBI number 29 this season, and the Nationals lead 7-5. Gilmartin kicks, fires. Breaking ball driven deep left center field. Granderson going back to the track, to the wall. It's gone! Second home run in two innings for Anthony Rendon. He's got a career high six runs driven in. The Nationals hit double digits and a 10 5 lead over the Mets. It's Rendon's first career two homer game. Anthony Rendon is a one-man wrecking crew. Salas sets. 2-2 two -two to Rendon. Swing and a drive. Hit well to right center field. Lucar is going back. Way back. It is off the wall and in play. Turner has scored. Harper has scored. Here comes Murphy. He has scored. With a new single game. Runs battered in record for Anthony Rendon. So you remember where you were when Anthony Rendon singled, Homer twice, doubled, and drove in nine runs in one game. Unbelievable. It's the Nationals 13 and the Mets 5. Jose Reyes just said something to Rendon out there at second base. 
Rendon with his head down just shook his head back and forth. I don't think he could believe it. He almost had himself a grand slam as it hit off the three run mark for the Pirates on the out of town scoreboard. About two feet from the top of the fence. As a Nationals farmhand. The 2 1 launched to left field for Weeders. Forget about this one. It is long gone. Into section 105, about two rows shy of where Rendon hit his home run. Matt Weeters with home run number three. His first as a right handed hitter this year. And the Nationals tack on the extra point, lead 14 to 5. Weeters is two for two with two walks. He's had himself a day. A little smoker proved that one. 95 mile an hour fastball. He drilled it. And the ball continues to really carry well here at Nationals Park, but that ball was tattooed. Pitch. Fastball. Line drive. Left center field. Headed for the gap. This one is through and going to the wall. Zimmerman will jog toward the plate, and Murphy will jog into second. And the Nationals have a double-digit lead, 15 to 5. RBI number 26 in the month of April for Daniel Murphy, his ninth double of the season. Three balls, two strikes, the pitch. Swing and a line drive, base hit left field. Murphy's not going to try to score, though. Murphy just jogs to third. Anthony Rendon has a five-hit game. But Murphy, with a 15-5 lead, did not break aggressively off the bag and Rendon off the crack of the bat thought that might be his 10th RBI get, how many chances to get to drive in 10 <laughs> ground ball to short goes oh. through the wickets of Reyes and out in the left field Murphy will jog in to score Rendon will stop at second Taylor will get an RBI is that one is an error on Reyes 16 to 5 the 1-0. Swing and a line drive. Deep right center field. Going back Ligaris to the warning track. And this one's gone! A three-run homer for Matt Wieters. And it's a new Nationals record for runs in a game. They've scored 19 runs. My, oh my. A three-run homer for Wieters. His second in two innings. His fourth of the year. Nationals 19 Mets five. It was up to 34 pitches. Kolecki delivers. Harper swings and belts one. Deep right center field. Way back. Going, going. Gone. Goodbye. A laser beam of a line drive. Home run for Bryce Harper. And that one lands in section 142. Bang. Zoom goes Harper. It's his ninth home run of the year. RBI number 26. And the Nationals' record-setting day continues with the highest-scoring game in Nationals history. It's now Washington 20 and New York 5. He's been very productive. Overshift Freeman to the right side. He belts one high and deep to center field. Lagares going back, way back, going, going, and gone goodbye. Well beyond the center field wall. A tremendous home run for Adam Lind. It's his second pinch hit home run of the season and as a national. He's now five for ten as a pinch hitter. Adam Lind has added on for the Nationals. His second home run. He has nine runs batted in for the year. As Anthony Rendon comes to the plate, it's the Nationals 22 and the Mets five. Well, that's bad news, though. It clears the bases in front of Rendon. <laughs> He'll have to do it himself, Dave. Here's the pitch. Swing and a long drive. Deep left field. Way back. This ball is gone. Goodbye. Gone. Goodbye. Six for six in the game for Rendon. He's hit three home runs in the game. He has a single that drove in two. A double that drove in three. A solo homer, a three-run homer, a single, and another solo home run. Six for six with ten runs batted in. Unbelievable. It's the Nationals 23 and the Mets 5.